With a look at Governor Gavin Newsom's plan to ban gas-powered vehicles in California in just 12 years. As Governor Newsom continues his week-long trip to China, climate has been at the top of his agenda. And one of the major focal points of his visit includes his goal to ban the sale of all new gas-powered cars in the state over the next decade. 17's Capital Correspondent Aton Wallace tonight shares with you how the state is meeting that goal and what more needs to be done. I don't know if you took the gondola, we walked. Governor Gavin Newsom visiting the Great Wall of China. <laughs> it's the latest stop on his week-long trip in that country, a trip that so far has included a meeting with President Xi Jinping, a signing of formal climate memorandums of understanding with various Chinese provinces, and a tour of an electric bus depot and vehicle charging stations. Newsom says it all goes hand-in-hand hand with his goal to require all new cars sold in California by 2035 be zero-emission vehicles. We love to say about our state, the future happens happens in California first. And he says it's already happening, noting as of last spring, more than 1.5 million zero emission vehicles have already been sold in California. He also points to new data showing electric car sales are only increasing across the state, something he argues is getting California that much closer to his goal of phasing out new gas powered cars. Everyone thought that was a radical act. And they said, you're simply over your skis. We're not producing enough zero emission vehicles. There's no way we'll achieve it. And there's not enough market demand. In Q3 of this year, already 27% of all cars sold in California are now zero emission vehicles. It's going to make a world of difference for people in our community and our environment to make sure that we have a sustainable future. Assemblymember Pilar Schiavo is the chair of the Assembly Select Committee on Electric Vehicles and Charging Infrastructure. The committee met this week to address what the state is doing to ensure the transition to electric vehicles does not leave out underrepresented communities. There's lots of great new innovation that's happening um, in this space and in LA specifically. You know, there's work to just put up chargers as quickly as possible on light poles, which can be put up really quickly. They're really easy to use. We went and toured one after the hearing. And, um, you know, these are just right there on the street for people when they need them. And they make sure that they put them around apartment buildings where people are going to need that kind of access. The Newsom administration says so far there are more than 90,000 chargers statewide. But a recent government report found by the end of the decade, California will need 1.2 million to keep up with demand. That, in part, is why Republicans say they believe the governor's goal are unrealistic. There is no plan. It's all pie in the sky. It's all uh, hype. And that's exactly what Governor Newsom does. He hypes it up and moves on to the next issue. We're, we're crisis management here in California all the time because it is lack of leadership when it comes to really deliverables. And the governor is set to return from China this weekend at the state capitol. Eitan Wallace, 17 News.